Hello all, greetings, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do another update my binder with me. Here is my little like overview, I guess, of what I'm going to be putting away today. Some girl groups, a um, little bit of Seventeen, some TXT, and some Stray Kids, BTS of course. Um, so that's what I'm going to be putting away today. Um, really exciting stuff. Also, I want to give a big, big thank you to everyone who has subscribed to me. I have just hit a thousand subscribers <laughs> not too long ago, and I just want to say just completely and totally thank you so much. I'm glad that people are enjoying my content about my K-pop collection, my journey with K-pop, so I really just genuinely appreciate all of you who are subscribing and liking and just commenting and interacting. It really helps me out a lot and encourages me to keep on going, so thank you so much. All right, sappiness out of the way, let's just get into this update. All right, so we're gonna start with 17. I have the least amount to put away in this binder, so we're gonna start there we're gonna go all the way to the back yes we're gonna go back here after right here and i'm putting in a nine pocket actually two of them so here are the cards that I'm going to be putting away. It is a complete OT13 set from 17's In The Soup. If you pre-ordered the In The Soup uh, episodes to start watching them, um, you can get these cards, which is amazing. This Hoshi, are you joking? It's so, so cute. I just, oh my god, I'm losing it, his beanie, I just can't, and this Minghao, I, and, oh my god, I just, I'm <laughs> losing my words because it is just, they are all so stunning so i'm gonna put them away in here starting with our leader s coops and then here is jung han looking so handsome and here is joshua And June. And here's Hoshi. Horong Hei. Hoshi. So, so, so cute. And here is Wanu in his bucket hat. He looks absolutely adorable. I love him. And his glasses. <laughs> it makes my heart melt. He's so, so handsome. And Woozy. I already looked at it again, but I have to. It's just, he just is, he's everything to me. And Minghao. And the backs are all the same. They just say in the soup. And here is Mingyu. <laughs> I love this bucket hat. It's so precious. He is so precious. He's just like the cutest. Okay, so here is one full page. I have been absolutely adoring in the soup for 17. I love when BTS had their first season. They're having a second season. That's exciting. And that they did photo cards for 17. I was like, this is great. I love this so much. It's been such a calming, relaxing experience to watch. I absolutely adore it. If you have not seen In the Soup for either 17 or for BTS, if you're a fan of both or just one of them, I recommend watching it. It's, I, I love it a lot. All right, continuing on, here is DK with some flowers or just some greenery because he is a flower. Actually, I have four cards, so I'm going to put DK up here. And here is Sun Kwan. So, so precious and cute in his hat. And Vernon <laughs> looks, oh my gosh, he looks so, so, so good. And last but certainly not least, Dino. I have particularly enjoyed Dino in In the Soup, just his constant laughter and talking with all the members. I just really, he's just, I find him so endearing. He's so, so precious. Okay, and also really exciting. 
I do have some white sleeves, which I almost never have. I finally got some more, um, and I wanted to show which ones I actually use. These are kind of the cheaper versions that you can get on Amazon, since I'm only using them as, like, you know, placeholders. So that is what I use. And here are the card sleeves that I actually use to sleeve my cards. Um, for 17, I use the Clear Classic, and for most all my other groups, I use the Clear Classic. But I use the clear matte for BTS, TXT, and Malamu, quite literally for no other reason except that um, <laughs> my photo card collections for BTS, Malamu, and TXT, um, I only had these at the time that I was sleeving a bunch of them, so now I just use them all. Um, but the clear classic is what most people use, but I also like the clear matte. Um, also, these are sold out most of the time so just having another option is pretty nice too so those are exactly what i use you can find them on amazon like i said here's what they look like um just because a lot of people ask all the time um, but i want to show what they look like so here we are Great! Oh my gosh, so good. So there is all the In The Soup cards that I have. I do have one more thing to put away for 17. It is a larger item. Let's go way back here. We'll go here. So here is what I have to put away. It is a bunch of these Hoshi um, cards from You Make My Day and You Made My Dawn. I believe that they are actually like Kino cards. I believe that's what they are. Um, again, I got them in my Hoshi bundle and <laughs> again, wasn't expecting to collect these, but I have them. So I'm going to put them away in here. So let's do You Make My Day and You Make My Day. Oh, these are all... Oh, this one is You Made My Dawn. Okay. So we'll put you down there. I absolutely adore this picture of Hoshi. He just looks so stunning. The lighting and everything is gorgeous. The Set the Sun version is definitely my favorite from You Make My Day, personally. <laughs> um, we'll do... How are we doing this? Sure, <laughs> we'll do it like that. Um, but I had to wait to put these away. I put that, I put this the wrong way. <laughs> Why did nobody tell me? Anyway, I had to wait to put these away because I had to wait until I got a four pocket page because I had every other sized <laughs> and shape page except for four pockets for the longest time because I really didn't need it and I didn't feel like... <laughs> buying a whole other package of it but um i need it now so i have it so i'm putting it right in here so that is all i have to put away for 17. let back Ugh. getting very thick i'm gonna need to get a new binder i keep saying that but i will do it eventually <laughs> Okay, here is my girl groups binder, my giant girl groups binder. Um, I have a few cards to put away for all the groups that I collect. That's pretty cool. We're going to start with Mamamoo. I have one card to put away here, and it is this Mungyo card. Let's see, this is the red back, so it is going to go right here. Fantastic. And I gotta start white sleeving places that did not have white sleeves, so I gotta stay on top of that. But yay, only one more card next left for the <laughs> dingo version for travel. Um, I think I've said before that but one star is very, very expensive on Mercari Japan, and she's a pretty popular 
remember to collect, so I usually have a hard time with her. But, oh, wait, I do have more to put away for Mama Moo. Gotta keep going. Here we go, my girl, Wien. It's some more Make Star Red cards for her, which is very cool, very exciting. So I'm going to put that away. Right here. She has quite a lot of other pre-order benefit cards for her album Red that I plan to get, but these ones look so nice and cohesive together because she's in her same outfit. So I'm very happy to have all of them. And I'm going to keep the setup like this, even though it doesn't look aesthetic, um, but I'm going to be putting, obviously, her other pre-order benefits on the same page. So I'm just going to white sleeve it for now. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Let's see what else... Let me white sleeve this page as well, since I can. <laughs> I almost never have these, so now I'm going to go crazy today. Me realizing that I have done no progress on Wien's collection. That makes me so sad. I'm so behind on my mom with collection. I'm a very bad Moo. <laughs> I gotta stay on top of this better, but I just white sleeved off camera a couple other um, places. I am still looking for this last clear card that I need. I feel like that one, it's them like inside their airstream and I can't find it anywhere. It's so frustrating that, I, that I'm desperately looking for a clear card. <laughs> I didn't expect that. But um, yeah, so this is all for Mama Moo. Let's go next to twice. And here I have Sana's Hollow card from Weiss Coaster Lane 1, which is super exciting. I finally have my top three, even though this is an OT8 set that I'm going to be collecting. Getting my top three out of my way is my number one priority first, and then I'll continue on. Um, but let me get this ugly, like, orange <laughs> sleeve out of here and put in some white sleeves, because it just looks so much better so so nice i know this is not like the most um, organized page ever because like twice goes to lane one and two um but i don't love having just like one card on a page all the time if i can avoid it so um that's what i'm gonna do for now these cards here i also just am not <laughs> prioritizing this era of collecting for twice um i'd rather finish these other eras but let me actually white sleeve this as well i surprisingly have all of sana's twice instagram cards very exciting but i have none of jellyon super weird i should get on that okay so what is love let's go here I have here Sana's signature card. She looks so cute in the PJs. I absolutely adore this card. It's so, so cute. <gasps> Yay! Oh my gosh. That is so exciting. So I finished my OT9 sets. This page is done. And now here, I have another Sana. It's her like twice logo card. So we're going to put her in here. Just missing Jonghyun. That's surprising. Okay. And I have here another Sana. It's her like letter card that spells out what is love. I'm not collecting that OT9 set, so I will not get the spelling of what is love. But I'm okay with that. <gasps> Yay! Oh my gosh. And then lastly for what is love... I have here uh, Jungyeon and Sana's scratch cards. Very, very cool, exciting. I'm super pumped about it. So here is Sana and Jungyeon. 
Yay! Oh my gosh. So, for What is Love, I'm only missing Sana's dress card and Jungyun's Twice logo. I'm super happy about that. What is Love is such a pretty area to collect for cards. So, <laughs> I'm glad that I made this much progress and, like, in pretty good time. So, super cool. Okay, moving on. Let's go to past all this area. Where am I going? Oh, wait. Here. I have here Momo's OT9 card that I'm collecting for. Fantastic. Very, very exciting. So just three more members. So great. I still remember the day I pulled this Sana card. I will never forget it for as long as I live because this is one of my favorite cards in all of like twice cards. Oh, so happy. Okay, let's move on to Fancy. I have Nyan's card for my OT9 set. Oh my gosh, yay! Nyan is notoriously a member that I just have a really difficult time finding. But this is so satisfying to look at oh my gosh yay yes oh my gosh so pretty i love this set so so much honestly um fancy era cards are really pretty too i like the colored borders that they have for almost all the cards so exciting let's move on i have sana's fancy letter card here as well under there and that is it oh my god i just completed fancy oh my god that's so exciting so my ot9 set and my top three for fancy is all done that's so exciting oh my gosh what a good feeling that's fantastic super exciting oh my gosh that's so exciting okay let's move on here I have Diane's flower signature card. Oh, yay! And I think that means I am all done with my top three or feel special. Yes! Oh my gosh! So cool! So all done with my top three for feel special. I am now just going to be working on this OT9 set. Um, which everybody collects for, so good luck to me on that. Um, and then, oh, I have cards to put away here. Here we go. I have Nyan and Momo's gold card. So here is Nyan. Very happy to found her. And Momo, also very happy to have found this card. For some reason, it's uh, more overpriced. I don't know why. The gold cards usually are not, you know, they're kind of, you know, they're just the gold cards. <laughs> so, oh my gosh, almost done with this one. Just need Young and Mina. Cool. Okay, so move along here. <gasps> Wait a minute, hold on. I have to go back. One card to put away. I have Cheyong. <laughs> oh my gosh, so exciting. Yay! Okay, major progress on this OT9 set. This is so exciting. Yay, oh my gosh. Okay, I'm done now with Feel Special, I promise. Continuing on. Nothing in more and more. I have Nyan, finally. Here she is, the last one I needed yet again. But I finally have her. Oh, wow, that is absolutely stunning to look at all together. Finally done, finally, I am done with this set. And just seeing all their colors on the back, so pretty. 
So eyes wide open, I've also completed my OT9 set and I've had my top three done for a while. So uh, that is such a good feeling to complete some sets for twice. And going by, actually, there's nothing I have to put away here. So let's move on now. I have nothing to put away for Itsy, but they're having a comeback soon. Here I need. So I have this Aisha card for Everglow, and actually, I'm going to take out the group cards. And I'm gonna put Aisha up here. There we go. Perfect. So that was all I had to put away for Aisha. Um, but I'm going to add a page. I'm going to add a nine pocket page here. And for the group cards, I'm going to just put them here. Because um, there are more group cards for Everglow that maybe I'll get more of. But I just don't want the group cards to be taking up space where regular album cards are gonna go. Cool, okay. So that was good. And now moving on all the way to the back here. Red Velvet. So for starters for Red Velvet, I'm going to white sleeve all of these empty spaces from albums that I either don't have yet or I just have not had the cards, which is a majority of Red Velvet's albums. Unfortunately, I have not been a very good collector of Red Velvet. Okay, properly, white sleeved, as she deserves. Obviously, always prioritize my alt groups and Red Velvet's albums. A lot of them are out of print. And the member I collect, Silly, is um, usually overpriced. Which, honestly, <laughs> all of Red Velvet's cards are pretty overpriced. Um, Irene, especially. I'm, <laughs> I'm glad I'm not an Irene collector, I will say that. But Joy is my bias wrecker, <laughs> so I do have her cookie jar card. Um, I tried to trade for it for Silgies, but I just couldn't find anybody who would actually trade me for it. <laughs> they just wanted to buy it for me, but I'll just keep it since she is my bias wrecker. But here is a land pocket page. And here are the cards from Queendom. Um, I do have a Joy card that I'm just keeping because I really like it. But let's just put away um, some of these cards. So I'm going to... Let's see, what am I going to do here? I'll put Joy down here. And this card is her selfie, so I'll put it in the middle. She does have another selfie um, that I will get eventually, but for now, I'm just going to put these two that I pulled on either side of her, just for now, <laughs> for no other reason. Very happy with my pulls from Queendom. 
I pulled a lot more of Silky than I ever thought I would, so I'm very, very happy with that. And also just very happy to have experienced a Red Velvet comeback properly. So happy. Um, okay, so I do have some larger stuff to put away here. So, for starters, I have these bookmarks of Wendy and Yeti. And I'm going to put them in here, even though I don't collect them. Um, I can't really do too much trading at the moment since I'm going to be moving, so I'm going to just put them here because I do really like them. I love all the girls from Red Velvet. Um, so some of my larger inclusions I'm going to put in here. This binder is going to burst. I really need to get like three more. Okay, so I do have this large postcard that I pulled for Silky. Let me put her right here. Perfect fit. Very nice. And then here, I have Wendy and Joy, which I... Let's see, what am I going to do? Actually, um, I have Silky's on the way to me here, so I think I'm going to actually put Wendy here and put no I'll put Wendy up here Silky's will go there and then over here I'll put Joy up here Silky's there so there okay. that's good next I have Silky's little like member card from the like jewel case version. Very happy to have pulled her. Um, I'm going to put her up here. Again, another reason why I had to get the four pocket pages. And then here I have Yeti. I have two of Yeti. And I'm gonna just put them here. Again, I don't really have much time to be trading, so I'm gonna just keep stuff for now. And then here's Wendy. Yeah, just happy to have some more red velvet stuff. This is kind of nice. And then here, I have Yeti and Irene, and I'm going to just put them in here. I would like to get Silkies eventually, but that's okay. Eventually I'll get it. But yeah. So that is what I have for Red Velvet. Just have that one um, silly postcard on the way, and that's all I have kind of waiting, but I'm really happy to have some more Red Velvet. Love the girls. Alright, next, Bangtan Binder OT7. Let's get into it. Uh, not too much to put away in here, only a couple things. Uh, let's go towards the back. Actually, here. Exactly here. I have here, finally, I have Yoongi's Lenti for the Wings Concept Book. Oh my goodness! This is so exciting. There it is. So I'm going to be putting it here. And that is going to be all for me for the Wings Concept Book. Uh, I pulled Jin in my concept book and I just want to get Jimin and Yoongi and I'm very happy <laughs> with that um having that amount it's not it's not something I'm interested in to collect for OT7 so yay I'm happy to have my top two boys and then of course Mr. Sokjin moving on here Speaking of Mr. Sokjin, our worldwide handsome, I finally have his card for this set, and I will be completing this set today. Oh, 
yay oh my goodness oh my gosh so so exciting um i actually have to go back to the beginning because i forgot to put something away back 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 this way here we go i have tete's dark and wild card oh my god this is very very exciting oh yes oh my goodness these eight pocket pages sometimes things kind of try to slip out a little bit but it's all good and now i just need silk gins and it is coming to me in my next neokyo haul my next neokyo haul will have every single bts card that i need left so i'm very excited to finally have that also really quick i wanted to share recently what i got I recently got a BTS tattoo and I wanted to share it with you all. This is my tattoo right here. It says save me and I'm fine with the hot air balloon from the save me young forever album and then I'm fine which is from love yourself answers album. So yeah here it is. If you follow me on my Instagram you already know that I have had this for like about two weeks now um, but <laughs> subtle plug to go follow me on my Instagram but uh yeah I got this because um Save Me is the song that made me an army after I was kind of diving into BTS this song just kind of hit me <laughs> in a certain way and Young Forever is one of my favorite albums Idol Era was my first official comeback as an army and when I heard I'm fine I heard like the familiar beginning of Save Me and I was like <gasps> Oh my god I just kind of like broke down it was really emotional so save me and I'm fine are very near and dear to my heart those two albums are very near and dear to my heart because of just my journey with BTS so yeah I got a BTS tattoo super fun super exciting um wanted to share okay moving right along after that we're gonna go all the way back to the back to butter Quite a journey to get back here. Uh, let's go right here. I have here Yungi and JK's uh, Weaver's Prayer to Benefit for Butter. So we're gonna put them away. Here's JK and Yungi. Yay! Oh my gosh, so exciting. And moving right along, no lucky draws today, but they are coming, I promise. But I do have message cards, so we're going to put away RM. So we're going to... how did I do this? Oh, this way? Yes, right there. And in we go. Very, very exciting. And then I also have J-Hope's message card right here very very cute he looks adorable um i did want to give a quick shout out to lucy who reached out to me and actually gifted this j-hope message card to me it was super super sweet i really appreciate it um if you're watching thank you so much i really thought it was so sweet so thank you Still missing Jimin, but he's on the way to me. <laughs> Last but not least, my ultimate alt on my way to me. Okay, so next, here we're going to put away some larger items. So first, I have here RM and J-Hope's um, Japanese like pre-order benefit sticker. Um, it is a sticker and it's kind of large. There are Weavers, not Weavers, they're Japanese pre-order benefits um, through Weavers that are the same style as this, but they're photo cards. 
Um, they are a little too expensive right now, so I will be waiting to get those. Um, but I will be getting all the stickers and all of these eventually, but not right this second. But I'm going to just put Memdunes and J-Hopes in here, and then the other members just have it ready for them. And then over here, I actually need another one of these. Okay, so next, I have here four members film strips, which were pre-order benefits. I have Yingi, Hobie, Timin, and Jungkook. And I'm going to be placing them in this six pocket page thing. How you ask, I will show you. But um, I was going to buy like these film strip pages because they have them, they exist, that like can fit them all on here. Um, I just don't want to buy <laughs> too much more things since I am going to be moving. So at this moment in time, I will not be doing that. But let's do... I'm going to be putting them in here just to have them safe. So let's see. I'm going to put... Yungi right here and I'm gonna just do that he is sticking out a little bit um, but it will be safe in here I promise and then here is Hobie I absolutely love Hobie's like he's just like what are you doing sir you just really came to murder us all um, they are also all in like their protective plastic still I'm not going to be taking them out because <laughs> I'm scared too so that is what I'm doing with that. And then, of course, we have Jimin. Looking so cute. Chloe cutie. And then, of course, Jungkook. Yeah. So, we'll put Jungkook and Jimin. Um, yeah, I believe I only have Namjoon's on the way to me. So, um, Jin and Tae, I'm not... Uh, I don't have them on the way to me, um, so when, after I move, maybe I'll try to find them, <laughs> but they're not, nothing high on my priority list right now, but I'm happy to have at least these four. So, that was all for BTS today. Okay, one more binder. Alright, last binder. Let us get into it. So, today I have uh, TXT and Stray Kids to put away. So, go TXT's newest repack album is what I'm going to be focusing on today. So, here are the cards that I have to put away. I only got one set of each version, so um, this is all I have for the cards. Um, after I move, like I said, I will be actively looking for the rest but let's see here so i need to put can't remember how i have this set up so here we got bumgyu going on this page for that version and then hyun kai down here and i need more nine pockets Okay, continuing on, here is Tan. These are the jewel case cards. Here is Bumgyu going over there. And then these seeker cards, I have Hyun and Kai and Subin. Okay, so off camera, I just went sleeve everything. How satisfying. I've never been able to actually do this. Um, so yeah, that is what I have just as placeholders now for TXT. And we're going to move on now to Stray Kids. All the way back here. And I have here some I Am Who cards for Chen. So exciting. I am gonna do here and here. 
oh my gosh this is very exciting um i'm gonna put that white sleeve actually up here because i can do that <laughs> very very cool making some progress on his collection my very small chan collection and let's move on here to this card which i'm gonna put right here and actually put that white sleeve back up here cute very very cute um okay that's just the empty placeholder for cards i don't have yet but we're gonna go here and i have a lot more pages to put in here just in case here we go and here are all the cards I am putting away and you might be thinking hey those are majority not Chan cards you will be correct as I say that um, I like I said since I'm moving I don't have time to trade and I am considering collecting some OT8 sets um, I'm not collecting OT8 just some sets so I can't decide right now so for now I'm just gonna put the cards that I pulled in here <laughs> with the sets that they are and like this red set is here and the this set here does that make sense what I'm doing here making it go like this way with whatever set it is as you can see the backs are different um, this is the humbug set And then here I do have four members, so we'll put, let's see, we'll put Chen here. This is not in any kind of order. <laughs> this is not in any kind of well done order in any way, I realize that. Um, but yeah, we'll do that. And then the... Um, double-sided card is the only set that I'm kind of convinced that I'm going to collect OT8 for. So I think it's Chen and then Mino, Changbin, Felix, no, Changbin, Han, Hyunjin, Jisung, right? Yes, Felix, uh, Seungmin, I am. All on one side <laughs> oh my gosh okay so yeah that's the only set that I'm like yeah I'll collect OT84 and I need another page right yeah I do but hold on one sec so this OT8 set here uh, let's do Mino Changbin Hyunjin Jisong Felix Sungmin and I am Oh my gosh, so, so pretty. Let me white sleeve the rest of these.
Alright, so that is that for now. Um, I need one more page. This page to put away these pre-order cards. <laughs> so the black ones, I will put these up here because eventually I will get Chen's. I'm not going to be collecting any more of these cards. They are kind of awkward to try to get in this page. So waiting for Chan's to go there, and then how might we do this? So we'll do Lumo, Jianbin, and Hyunjin. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> and I'll put Chan's eventually. I think like the red one at least in the middle there. I think that would make sense. Okay, so that is what I did for Stray Kids. Again, this OT8 set I definitely want to collect for. The other ones, I'm not sure yet. We'll see how easy or difficult it will be for me to get Chen, and I'll go from there. But the cards I have now, I'm just going to hold on to them um, after I move. <laughs> we'll see how I feel. Okay, so this was everything I had to put away in my binder for today. Um, I really hope that you enjoyed. Um, <laughs> thank you again for a thousand subscribers. It really means the world to me. I'm quite, quite just so happy about it. I really just thank you. Thank you so much. Um, if you have not subscribed already, please subscribe and hit that like button and comment below. I obviously love to talk about K-pop and my collection. And um, if you collect a similar group as me or a similar member, love to talk about it. It just brings me just so much joy. But thank you so much for watching, and until I see you guys in my next video, bye bye